Right children, this morning we're going to practice some written methods of subtraction. This is a very simple example. We've got 7, take away 5, leaves 2. 5 or 50, take away 2 or 20, leaves 3, 30, answer 32. This example is a little harder. We've got 5, take away 3, leaves 2. Now, in the tens column we have 30, take away 50 which we can't do because 50 is bigger than 30. So we need to borrow from the hundreds column. So I'll cross my hundreds out, make that zero, and then borrow that hundred across to the tens column. Now I have 13, take away five, which I can do, it's eight. Then I have nothing left in the hundreds, so my answer is 82. This last example is the most tricky because we have a zero here in one of the numbers. So seven, take away eight, I can't do. But I can't borrow from here because there's nothing here. So I need to come across to the hundreds column this time. So instead of that being 600, I should make that 500, borrow 10 across to there like before. But I don't need it in this column, I need it in this column. So I cross that out and borrow again, making that 10 into a nine, borrow the 10 across here. 17, take away eight, I can do now. So 17, take away eight, we'll leave nine. 9, take away 3 here, would leave 6. 5, take away 5, leaves nothing. 4,000, take away nothing, leaves 4,069. Done.